How to get Fisted 101. Step 1. Make a YouTube channel. Step 2. Join my cinema. Step 3. Fisting. <laughs> So basically, a couple days ago, I asked on Twitter what video should I make, and the majority of you guys said that I should talk about why I quit Machinima. So here I am to explain to you exactly what happened between me and Machinima, and why I decided that, you know what, it's done, we're done. I basically got so fed up with Machinima, I was on the edge of just fucking deleting my channel. N not really, but kind of. Basically, for a long time, Machinima was actually something that prevented me from making videos in a way I, it would demotivate me to make videos i'll just be angry to make videos like it wouldn't be as fun as it should be but before we get into the nitty and gritty and all the bad stuff let's let's roll the tape back a little bit let's go back four years in time because that's that is when i joined machinima i joined machinima four years ago i was young impressionable and stupid back then and basically machinima took advantage of my stupidity and basically being young and, young and stupid, not really knowing what I'm getting into. So back then, Machinima was very big and very reputable, like being a Machinima partner, Machinima director was like a big deal. It was like, holy shit, you made the big leagues pretty much. So you know, my channel started to grow and it actually started to grow at a rapid pace. I was getting quite a lot of views and quite a lot of subscribers for a 15, 15 14 year old back then that was just kind of insane and basically machinima was like hey this channel is growing let's contact him so when i got an email from a machinima person i was like hey we be like what you're doing on youtube why don't you come join us o of course i fucking went nuts and i was started just partying and being like hell yeah boys we're making the big leagues i was honestly thinking that this is it this is the point where i go fucking youtube famous boys because this was back when for example, Uber Hexer Nova, uh, Beijing Canadian, uh, basically all these like big YouTubers were making videos on Machinima for Machinima, and they were all being partnered for Machinima at that time. So like when Machinima actually said like, "Hey, we want to you know partner you," I was like going nuts. I went nuts. I mean, <laughs> some of you might remember my video for when I joined Machinima. Uh, don't go looking for it, that shit's private. But I kind of went nutty, I went nuts about it. But hey, I was young, I was excited, I was going to become a big deal. So some time passes by basically, and Machinima are like, hey, you should come and join us. And then they're like, you know, you will have our partner support, you will have access to all our features like music, etc. Uh, we will personally look at your channel and tell you how you could improve. We'll, you know, promote your channel. We will uh, better, like, we'll talk to advertisers and suit advertisers better to your channel, which means more money for you, bigger revenue from ads. So you, everything was like, holy shit, this is it. This is happening right now. I'm going big. And so, of course, I signed the contract with Machinima, I think around December. Which was like, hey, awesome, I signed the contract, my dad had to co-sign the contract because I wasn't an adult yet. And so I was like, cool, now I'm going to be making money, and I'm going to be sick, it's going to be great, I'm going to be big on YouTube. So the first month goes by, and I'm like, okay, maybe it takes a little bit of time for them, you know, to process everything and be like, oh, okay, here, here's what you need to do to improve your channel. So I wait a little bit, another month goes by, so I reach out, and I'm like, hey... How do I grow my channel now? When are you guys going to promote me? When are we going to make some, some sort of a series or something? A video where I can post on the channel or something like that? And I got, I got no answer back. Nothing. The first two or three months go by and I still haven't been paid. I am yet to be paid in three months. So of course this is a big concern. I'm like, okay, why is this happening? Where is my money? I am a 15 year old that needs to buy shit and I want my money. So of course I contact the partner support and they're like, uh, we'll look into it. I'm like, okay. So another month of this bullshit goes by, still not paid, still not promoted, still no one talked to me about my channel, nothing was happening. So I just got kind of frustrated and I started emailing like, all right, okay, when there's stuff going to happen? And for a long time, nothing happened until I was like, you know what? I'm fucking done with this. I talked to my dad. My dad's like, listen, we got lawyers. We will lawyer up and we'll get your money back. Oh man, it sounds so fucking stupid now that I say it. Somehow that worked. I received my payments from that point on. But the first couple of months, that money is fucking gone. I have not seen that money ever since. So the time rolls by, everything is not great. 
no one reaches out to me and it's now over a year over a year of me making videos on and off and just being annoyed at the fact that I'm like not big on YouTube yet and I'm not growing at the pace I want to be growing at. And basically within that time, now within a year, I was like, this is not happening. I've been lied to. I've been cheated. Done. Nothing. I'm done with this company. I am done with everything. So I go and try to scrap my contract. I'm like, okay, guys, we need to part ways. This is not working out for us. And they're like, heh. I'm really confused as to what do you mean I you didn't do your part of the contract I'm doing my part I'm making videos you guys literally didn't do anything you offered me none of the promises you said ever happened no you cannot scrap your contract why is that why can't I do that because there's a clause in the contract a three year locking contract with no way to actually just just quit you can't quit you're stuck with us for three years. That's fucked up. First of all, the split of the money was shit for me. It was a 60-40 split, which meant I was taking 60%, they were taking 40% on top of YouTube already splitting their 60%. So, and then taxes on top of that. So I was getting the shit end of the stick and they were taking 40% for alleged promotion and helping with the channel. None of that happened. In the meantime, I was getting strikes, I was getting copyright strikes, copyright notifications, all that shit. I was like, hey, Machinima, can you help me out with that? Nah, sorry, we don't do that. We, we can't help you with that. Literally, they couldn't help me with my copyright channel. So, like, the reason of joining an MCM is promotion and protection from copyright, right? Well, that didn't happen. Machinima just told me to deal with it on my own. They were like, this is not what we do. We don't take care of your shit. So I was like, okay, that's fucked up. I even asked for them to maybe help me get a ticket to, for example, uh, like either like E3 or Gamescom or anything. They were like, no, we don't do that. We give out tickets to only certain people in the company. I was like, great, you're literally worthless. You're taking 40% of my money for doing jack shit. Basically, I was just getting robbed. I was getting robbed on the daily because none of the promises, they were, I was promised fucking gold and being a king of YouTube and I just got anally fucking fisted with nothing in return. I was the one being fucked and I had to pay them for getting fucked. So the three years roll by, three years of pain and misery with Machinima and I'm like, alright guys, we be done here. And they're like, not so fast. What do you, what, what do you mean, wait, 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 hold on, hold on, what, what do you mean not so fast? And then Machinima drops the bomb on me, they're like, you didn't activate your clause of wanting to quit Machinima, which is mind blowing because I stated six on diff six different occasions, six different months. I was like, I want to be done. I'm done within like basically within the three years with six different times. I contacted them being like, I'm done. We want, I'm just, I want out. I want out of Machinima. I don't want to take part of this at all. And so they kind of clause in the contract where I had to do it specifically 60 days before the contract ended or otherwise it extended for one year, one extra year. That's right. Automatically just extends for an extra year if I don't contact them on the 60th day of my contract expiration, like 60 days before it expires. So I got super pissed and that was like a total demotivation. I was like, you know what? Why the fuck do I make videos now? Like, this is stupid. My shit, my money is being taken away from me buy a company that doesn't offer me anything they promised me all these cool things all this cool shit and they just went off there you know it was machinima it was a big deal so they went off with that and they came to me and they're like hey you should come and join us so of course i joined and then a couple months after i joined about six to eight months after i joined machinima opened its doors to anybody anybody could apply for a partnership with machinima and they started getting partnerships left and right anyone you could have 10 subscribers you could get a partner in machinima basically they went for the mass numbers mass subscribers so they amounted like hundreds and hundreds of channels thousands lots of channels they just grabbed all of them and were taking 40 percent from every channel so of course they wouldn't promote my channel because i was like i was the first basically a test batch of the small youtube channels and they were like hey this is actually profitable so let's just grab everybody so that's fucking abel shit but thankfully, since December, I am no longer Machinima. I am now on my own. It's just me and YouTube AdSense, which took about three months to fucking set up. I'll talk about that on a different day, about YouTube AdSense and that whole thing. But this is a warning from me to you. If you're a YouTuber out there, if you're a small YouTuber and you want to join an MCM, do not join Machinima. Whatever you do, don't go for Machinima. 
doesn't matter what they promise you, they will not deliver it. I personally promise you that, that they will not deliver anything to you. Mashima does not give a shit about you, they don't care about your channel, the only thing they care about is that monthly 40% paycheck they get from your channel. Doesn't matter if you make a dollar a month, doesn't matter if you make a thousand dollars a month, they will take that 40% and they will fucking flip you off and they'll be done. Oh, you wanna get promoted? Fuck you! But yeah, guys, that is pretty much it from me. I'm done here. Uh, that was my little story. Maybe I'll make a part two if I didn't explain anything properly here. But basically, do not join much cinema. That's the short end of it. And I got fucked by them. That's it. That That's all the story here. So make sure to click the like, click subscribe. So help me out with my channel, please. Because my channel's dead. I'm fucking dead, boys. So thank you very much for watching. And I think you should check out this video right here. Because this video is sick. It's an amazing video. I picked it specifically for you. So thank you for watching. Go check out this other video. Subscribe, like, favorite, comment, all that. And of course, my links to Twitch and Twitter are in the description. Peace.